Okay, let's switch the keyboard on. This is the power button, press it once. The screen will light up and after a brief greeting, the grand piano sound will be selected as indicated here. The concert grand piano sound is the sound that always gets selected whenever you switch the instrument on. And now you can play. To select a different voice is very easy. Press the voice button there, and then we have this numeric keypad. All of the sounds can be selected by using one of the corresponding numbers on the numeric keypad. For example, 044 is guitar. Type 044 into the keypad. The screen changes to indicate what sound is selected and we can play it like this. Likewise, if I want to select a string sound, 077 selects the string category. 077, strings is shown in the display. We can also go between the individual categories. So if I press this plus button or this minus button, it will take me up one by one through the sounds. Live strings, standard strings, strings, chamber, marcato. Let's change to one more category. Trumpet. One, one, four. Now that's changing the sounds. How about selecting a rhythm style? Let's do that next. Okay, so we've selected the sounds using the voice button. Now let's select a backing style to go with it. Styles are great, you can play along with them. They keep to a tempo and they add more articulation and life to your playing. So we press the style button. Same applies, we've got a, a list on the right hand side of style categories. The numbers indicate what number to select on this keypad to go to that category. And in the case of this, as you notice, 031 is selected, which is Epic D Ballad. All we need to do now is switch the accompaniment on. It's very easy. Press this far left button. It's labelled ACMP on stroke off. Pressing it will light up a little indicator in the screen so that you know that it's selected and the accompaniment is switched on. What we want to do is start the style when we play the first chord. So sync start, press that and these arrows start flashing. That means it's waiting for us to start playing. We can go one step further here. We can press voice and press three zeros. What that then does is give us a one touch setting. So whatever style you select, it will automatically pick the most appropriate sound that it considers would work well with that style. So we can now listen to it after pressing intro and ending. That will give us a nice intro so take us straight into the style before we start playing. Let's have a listen. Pressing the ending button is great. When you finish playing your song, press the ending button and you'll get an ending which slowly fades the style out and brings a nice musical conclusion to your playing. To pick a different style is very simple. Press the style button, check through the style categories on the right hand side, select a category, we're going to select disco, zero, six, one. Disco selected. Now we already have the accompaniment selected. All that we need to do now is press sync start, intro, and then play. And now we're into the main part of the style. To end the style, press the intro stroke ending button.
If at any point in time we wish to go straight back to the piano sound that was present when we switched your instrument on, simply press this button, Portable Grand. That will clear all the settings that we've just made, take us straight back to the piano sound. That's how we use the styles.